Japan's electricity will soon be nuclear free for the first time in 42 years. Power company officials are about to shut down the country's last operating reactor for inspections. Officials at Hokkaido Electric Power Company say they'll start shutting down, shutting down the number three reactor at the Tomari nuclear power plant on Saturday. They say they'll complete the shutdown on Sunday. Officials at the Japanese power companies want to restart offline reactors across the country. Officials at the Japanese power companies want to restart offline reactors across the country. Oh my fucking god! They've submitted the results of stress tests on 19 reactors to the Nuclear Industrial Safety Agency. Government officials say two reactors at the Oi plant in the western prefecture of Fukui meet new safety requirements. They're trying to get people who live nearby to agree to a restart. But there's no prospect of operation of any of the country's 50 reactors. Japanese experts have developed a new method to estimate the power of an earthquake by using the Global Positioning System, or GPS. The method is expected to accelerate the process to issue tsunami warnings. This image reproduces the movements of the Earth's crust triggered by the massive earthquake that hit northeastern Japan in March 2011. The arrows show the extent and direction of the movements. In this case, the crust shifted significantly eastwards. The new system allows researchers to follow crust movements in real time using data from some 1,200 GPS observation points around Japan. It's expected to shorten the time needed to determine the magnitude of massive earthquakes from about one hour to several minutes.
Hundreds of babies in Japan have taken part in a sumo tournament, but they didn't have to wrestle. All they had to do to win was not burst into tears. Yo, yo. The infants faced each other in a sumo-style ring. When one started crying, the other was declared the winner. A Shinto shrine in the northeastern city of Hanamaki has held the tournament annually for more than 300 years. The sumo ritual is a way to pray for babies to grow up healthy. Some little ones lost their bouts by crying before they entered the ring. Others won by sleeping the whole time. That's all we have for now on Newsline. Thank you, thank you.